Well, good day everyone, welcome back. Um, today we're gonna mow the front lawn here, um, probably give it a bit of fertilizer, um, a granular fert, hasn't been done for about a month. Um, so yeah, it's looking really good. Keen to mow it, hasn't been mowed in a few days. Um, so it's looking like. Um, a lot of leaves from the tree. Um, but you know, you can't do anything about that. So yeah, mow it. Um, I'm mowing it on the lowest rotary setting, so I've got my um, rotary mower on the lowest setting, so that's good. I'm happy it's getting lower. Well, I can't go any lower, so yeah, looks good at that height. Um, mm. It's also a bit of seed head um, popping up, which I'm not too concerned about. Um, I'm pretty sure that's just from all the mowing I've been doing, because I've been mowing it about every second day, and that's made it thicken up a lot. Um, just because we're taking so much, we're taking a lot of leaf off quite regularly. Um, we're taking a lot of nutrients, so the lawn might be under a bit of stress um, because of we're taking away the leaf and we're taking all the nutrients. So we've got to put some nutrients back down there, which was what we'll do today. We'll fertilize that. Um, plus, it's also been a little bit hotter recently, so I might just still be adjusting to that. Um, yeah, apart from that, it's going really well. Got some nice color. It's tiff tough over here, it's going really good. Um, look at that, starting to fill in a lot more, which is really good. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll show you the seed head. The biggest sort of areas are like that. Um, yeah, classic sort of seed head. I'm pretty sure that's from all the, all the mowing we've been doing, um, because of the lack of nutrients, as I've said. Not lack, but you know, we've been taking so much leaf off, taking away the nitrogen, um, so we got to put that back in there and um, yeah, get it going again. So let's mow it, put the fertilizer down, and then I'll show you how um, the zoysia is going. Um, that's going really well, so let's give it a mow. Yeah, the height we're cutting that is right. Okay, yeah, 22 mil. Um, really big reel. That's just the quickest one I could find. Um, 22 mil, which isn't too bad. Um, would like to get a bit lower, but the rotary mower doesn't go any lower than that. So, what do you do? So yeah, the fertilizer I'll be using today um, is CK88. This stuff, um, similar, sort of to urea, I think. Or it just gives it a, it's high in nitrogen, really. Um, so it's, that's what it looks like. Right there, you've seen granule ferts before. High in nitrogen, um, not sure the exact prill size. Um, but I'm a big fan of it. I don't put it down too much. I really just put it down monthly, um, about every four to five weeks, really. Um, so yeah. Get this down, got an odd glove, so I'm uh, missing the other glove. Um, yeah, Oops. yeah, I'm a big fan of it. Um, similar to the Toothpack Accelerate, I believe, but it's a bit cheaper. Um, haven't tried the Toothpack Accelerate, but I've just heard it's pretty similar to it. Let's go. Yeah, really important you water it in straight away, otherwise you're going to burn the leaf. Um, 
Yeah, so I'm gonna get the water on it now. So while that's watering in, sorry about the background noise, um, I'll show you the zoysia. Um, yeah, it looks really good. Certainly very green. Um, obviously it's still the really slow grower zoysia in general, um, and it's even slower underneath a huge tree. Um, so yeah, you got a huge tree, all the leaves blow onto the cooch side, um, but yeah, trees are nice, so gotta have a bit of both. Um, so yeah, I think we'll leave the video there. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one. And uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe um, if you haven't already. Keeps me motivated to keep doing these videos, helps me get bigger. Um, yeah, I like this video if you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time, guys. See ya.